So the final question for tonight's panel is for everyone. And I think if you can say one or two sentences each, that'd be great. What is the single most important thing a medical student can do to prepare for success in vascular surgery? I'll go ahead and start if that's okay. Um, I think it has nothing to do with anything vascular related. This is once you start your vascular residency, you're not going to really look back at PEDS, GYN, neurology. So pay attention to all those other things. Be a star in all those other different subspecialties and rotations that you go through because you're never going to see those again. You'll work peripherally with them, uh, but you'll have enough time to focus on vascular when your vascular residency starts. So just focus on being a good doctor. There you go. All right, yeah. Um, yeah, I will echo that for sure. And also be yourself, okay? Just uh, be genuine to who you are. Uh, if vascular is really in your heart, uh, work hard for it. And you do everything you think you need to do to you know, check all those boxes, but never lose yourself in the process. Just because you like the idea of being a vascular surgeon doesn't mean that you have to be one. So if you love it and you really want to be that, just be yourself and you'll do great. And we can't wait to have you be part of our workforce. Yeah, I think be fearless. It echoes the same things. It, the stuff that's worth worrying about is worth worrying about, but most of it's not worth worrying about. And most of it's noise and you're gonna have to give up your hobbies and your work life now. That's all nonsense. Just be fearless about the decision and do it and enjoy it. Honestly, that's the big one. Uh, I'll just add a couple things. One, um, I completely agree. Uh, be, your, be the best medical student you can be right now. Number two, uh, enjoy and don't lose your don't lose your special hobbies or whatever it is that makes you happy. Do those things because that's honestly it's the things that like that that will keep you sane during residency when you're just busy and you're just going every day. You're just like going for, forward. Being able to have the time to cultivate those things is uh, the outside of medicine is is important. And the last thing I'll say is just because you're in training doesn't mean your life has to be on hold. So like whatever it is that's important to you that's uh, in moving forward with life, just keep doing those things. So we all make time for what's important um, somehow and those things will, will bubble up um, uh, as, you, as you progress through each stage of your training. Yeah, I think I'll just say, uh, make sure you love it because yeah, I, I think it's a great field and I think everybody sort of ends up finding their specialty. But um, I, I just think you're so much more set up for success and enjoying each day and enjoying the journey if you know that this is really the field for you and that you really enjoy doing it.